What's up guys, Will here, and I got something special for you today. As you can see, I'm playing some Mercenary Team Deathmatch. And who is that on the other team? Is that x the legend himself? Why, yes it is. And you know, most people would be frightened to see x on the other team. I'm not, you know why? Because I'm MLG legit. I go pro every day. I whoop up on people like x in my sleep. Okay, that's what I do. Because I'm so pro. And if you guys can't tell, I'm joking with you right now. I'm just totally messing. I'm definitely not that cocky, although... Sometimes I might be, but usually, most of the time I'm not. Uh, but first off, before I get into anything, I want to point out my starting route on Array, which I use every time. And uh, this is a really good route, and I suggest you run it. And uh, this is only a small clip before we get to the major forte of the video. And as you can see here, what do I do? Oh, I get a double kill on extra boy first blood. That's what I do. Uh, but anyways, I thought it was pretty cool that I got in a match with uh, extra even though... He was on the other team, and he, later he uh, left a little early, but whatever. I'd never been in a game with someone from uh, YouTube before, so I thought that was pretty cool. And uh, keep up the good work, Xdraws, because you were pretty good at this game. Uh, but now we're going to get into the main part of this video, which was a pretty awesome gun game I just had. And I thought I'd put it up because it is really... It's, a, it's one of my best gun games, I'd have to say. Uh, but then it goes into a whole boatload of fail. Like, honestly... I had some of my best streaks I've ever had in gun game. And it goes really good until I get to a ballistic knife where it goes uh, down the crapper from there. And you're going to see how much shit ton of fail there is. And uh, it was sort of depressing when it happened. But I thought I'd put it up anyways because I thought it was funny how I was doing so well on the guns. And then uh, when it got to the ballistic knife, it just uh, did not seem to work out. So let's get right into my tips. And my first tip for a gun game is when you're playing it, you need to get off to a really fast start because that's uh, pretty much what's going to determine the game and how the game's going to go. In the beginning when you have your pistol, you need to get off to a fast start and get onto your uh, shotguns and submachine guns really quickly. And that way you're going to be able to get uh, all those kills while they're still on the guns, uh, the pistols. And if you can do that, you're pretty much going to win the game because the guns on gun game, it's pretty much on like a linear graph where how shitty they are. You start off with really shitty guns, and then they progress to getting better and better, and then you end up with really shitty guns in the uh, end. So what you're going to want to do, uh, and right here I sort of failed, but what can you do about that? Uh, see, what you're going to want to do is when you have those good guns, you want to be pushing forward and pushing really hard to get those kills. Because when you have those good guns, it's going to be a lot easier to get the kills than when you're running around with a crossbow or ballistic knife. And this guy just sucks, and... I do have to say the guys in this match uh, weren't the best, you know, but what can you do about that? Because uh, what happens is when you get all those kills really quickly, unless you're somehow just like a super pro with the ballistic knife or crossbow, which I've never seen anyone that's been really good with that, but uh, I'm sure they're out there. But most of the time, uh, you're going to be taking a lot longer to get those kills than you are with the machine guns and everything, so you really need to be pushing hard when you have the guns like the FAMAS which are just going to be pooping on everyone. And if you can get off to a fast start, you get on the good streaks like these, you're going to be shooting guys that are still using the pistols and the shotguns while you have the, the Moss and the AK-74U. And I think we all know how that situation is going to work out. It's not going to end up too good for them. And another tip I have is when you're using these guns, like as you can see I have the M60 right here, and uh, I used to be really horrible with the M60, and I've gotten a little better. And my tip for you is if you're playing gun game and there seems to be uh, one weapon that you're having a lot of trouble with, go into the, some regular team deathmatch or ground war or whatever a game mode you like to play and just throw that uh, gun into a creative class and use it a lot. And that's going to help you get a lot better with, uh, and watch for the quick scope. Uh, never mind, that wasn't a quick scope. Skip that. And uh, another quick tip here. Uh, as you can see quickly, I look over here. And I figured that he'd spawn over in this area, and that's what you'd want to look for for these guys spawning. And he would have been funneled down there, but I just did that guy, so it works out in my favor anyways. So yeah, as I was saying, if you use a gun enough, you're eventually going to get better with it, and uh, that's going to help your gun game out quite a bit. And I guess I should probably do that with the crossbow and ballistic knife, because obviously I suck a tremendous amount of penis uh, with those guns, but... Hopefully with enough work I can get better at those and make sure that a game like this does not occur again. And the last tip I have about gun game, which I should have probably said in the beginning. Uh, as you saw in the beginning when I had the pistol, I just sat down in a bush and waited a little bit. 
And that's going to be uh, what I think. And I totally spaced that guy out on uh, Pride Rock or whatever they call it up there. Uh, but in the beginning, it's good to just sit down and wait a little bit. Because eventually Rambo is going to come running around looking to get a quick kill. And when that happens, usually you can uh, get the jump on him. Because if you're just running around, uh, yeah, you can probably get a kill. But I'd suggest just sitting down for a little bit, getting that first kill out of the way. And then starting on your little rampage that you're going to go to eventually. And as you can see, that's always a good spot that I've mentioned in my videos before. Where you can just peek through those bushes. And when you shoot that way, there's a bunch of sandbags all along the way there. And then cliffs on the other side. So they have nowhere to run. And then your grenade's pretty much going to explode somewhere because... It can't just fly off the edge. It's usually going to hit that. And I almost thought I hit that guy, but I missed. And before my uh, ballistics fail, I'm going to show you some crossbow fail right here. This guy just sits down here, and I looks like I shot him. I think I shot him right through his legs right there, but somehow I missed, and I missed again. But I jump down here, and I eventually get this guy right here, uh, but then he shoots me. But that doesn't matter. You stuck him, so you still get the kill. And... Uh, Welcome to the fail Taj right here. And uh, you might want to close your eyes for the horrendousness that's about to occur. Uh, but hopefully the good streaks in the beginning uh, helped you uh, and prepared you for the stuff that's about to happen. I think that guy just quick scoped me in the face. And right here I'm like, okay, I should probably get going a little bit. But uh, even with that prodding to myself, I don't seem to do any better. And I don't know why. It seems like... I always have good shots on these guys, but they just never work out, but what can he do? And I really don't have too much else to say about this game. You're just going to have to watch as I fail a tremendous amount of penis at this. And that guy, I think, was running across there and just fell straight down that little hole in the bridge there. And I missed my shot on him, so that's sort of uh, sad that I missed that, but whatever. And uh, hopefully you guys like that uh, little thing in the beginning. Uh, hopefully you like me giving X Jaws a little scare. I mean, he needs to step his game up, you know? I was coming right out there. They weren't even paying attention. I'm just messing there. But as you can see, that was probably the biggest fail I had in this entire game. He was sitting still for probably three seconds, and I missed my shot. And then I missed my second shot on him, which to me it looked like it should have registered, but... What can you do? And this is going to be the end of the game here. But hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video. And if you have, come check out my channel. And with that, I want to thank you guys for watching. And I'll talk to you guys later.